Hello everybody, I'm the Mexican Pig and today I'm doing a review on Dead Mouse's new album, Polar, the soundtrack to the Netflix movie. Before anything, I'd like to remind you of my Discord server, uh, links in the description, and I'd like you to subscribe to my YouTube channel, it's always appreciated. Uh, thank you very much. Also, the lighting is dark um, intentionally, just because of the theme of the, the album that I'm reviewing. This album was released on January the 25th, 2019, the same day that I'm that I wrote the scripts and that I'm recording right now. And Polar is a new action movie on Netflix that you can check out right now. And that's all I'm really going to say about the movie because this video isn't about that. We're talking about the film's soundtrack, produced by none other than Dead Mouse. And the soundtrack has 13 total songs. And the listing will be based on iTunes, just like I did for the Mouse Pro Level 2 review. And just like that review, I'm also going to rate each song. Uh, and then also rank each one from worst to best. And let's get started. First on the list we have Sewn. This song is just a remix of Silent Picture, a song from While One Is Less Than Two. And while the song is unoriginal, uh, it actually might even be better than the original song. Sewn gets a uh, 8 out of 10. Next on the list we have Cabin. This song stands out from the other tracks. Cabin has a nice tone, beat, and melody. Definitely one of the better ones here. Cabin gets a 9 out of 10. Third, we have Chill. This is a beatless remix of Somewhere Up Here, also a song from While One Is Lesser Than Two. Uh, overall, a very chilling and relaxing song. Uh, chill gets an 8 out of 10. Next, we have Sniper. The song is very fitting for a, an intense scene in the movie. There's not much to say about this. Uh, the song gets a 7 out of 10. Fifth, we have Torture. And this is probably the worst song on the album. While this is good for a very tense scene, it's not good for an album. And I know that this is a soundtrack and that this song can fit very well with a tense scene. And it's the same case for 10.8 from Mouseville Level 2. I give this song a four out of 10. Next, there is Midas's Heel. This is just the original version of Drama Free from Mouseville Level 2. Also, the instrumental version of that song was removed from Mouseville Level 2 for some reason. I don't know why, maybe because my Decision Seal is basically the same thing as the instrumental version of Drama Free. And while My Decision Seal wasn't made originally for um, the Polar soundtrack, uh, this song is a solid 9 out of 10. On 7th and 8th, we have Drugs and Wilhelm. They're almost the same song, but I think I prefer Wilhelm a little bit more. And they're both continuous uh, when, you put, when you play them back to back. They're both good songs and they get a 7 out of 10 each. Next we have Main. Like a few of the previous songs, this doesn't really fit for an album. I relate this song to Sniper and Torture. Again, they don't really fit for an album, but they fit great for an intense scene. Uh, Main gets a 5 out of 10. And 10th we have Nosedive. Before I listened to the album, this was the song that I was most excited for. And the reason why is because uh, Nosedive was released a long time ago uh, to YouTube. I don't remember what the song sounded like, but I do remember that it was um, definitely a pretty long song. It was uh, eight minutes long in the video. So I knew that I was gonna get a unique experience from this song uh, before I heard the album. And I was right. This song is eight minutes long and uses its time very well. Nosedive is loud, heavy, and dark. This song gets a solid 10 out of 10. 11th, we have Camilla. This song is lighter and more simple with a nice piano. One certain note from this song could have been changed and I would have liked it better. But this track is still really good. Uh, I think it was probably because uh, that scene was probably, I, I haven't watched the movie yet, but that scene was probably a more lighter toned one and the, the note was uh, much higher than I would have wanted it to be. So yeah, that's probably why. Camilla gets an eight out of 10. Next we have End. Like Chill, this is a remix of Somewhere Up Here from While One Is Less Than Two again, but this time, the song is almost exactly like somewhere up here. And is a little bit slower and darker and it uses a few different sounds. And I think it's a really good song. This song gets a nine out of 10 for me. Ending the album, we have Drama Free featuring Lights. Literally nothing different from the Drama Free in Mouseville level two. No different sounds, speeds, tones, or anything. Like Midas' Heal, this song wasn't made for the album, but it still gets a nine out of 10. And that's it for all the individual songs. Now it's time to rank each one from worst to best. On 13th place, we have Torture. It's not very pleasant to listen to. On 12th, we have Main. Um, fits for an intense scene, but again, not for an album. 
On 11th, we have Sniper. Um, good for an intense scene and pretty good for an album. Not, not as bad as Main and Torture. On 10th, we have Drugs. Good, but not very memorable. On 9th, we have Wilhelm. It's almost the same song as Drugs. On 8th, we have Sohn. It's good, but not as much as the other songs on the album. On 7th, we have Camilla. Great, but not perfect. On 6th, we have Chill, and the song is very cool and relaxing. On 5th, we have End. Great, but very similar to Somewhere Up Here. On 4th, we have Cabin. Very good and with a much different style. On 3rd and 2nd place, we have Midas' is Heal and Drama Free. Yes, they're both excellent songs but they're not originally from this album. And in number one, we have Nosedive. It uses its time very well, and it's so energetic and dark. It's just a great, great song. Overall, I give the album an 8.5 out of 10. While this album has some mediocre songs, most of the album is very good, unique, and dark. Let me know uh, what you thought of the album, the video, or the movie in the comments below. Thank you all for making it to the end of the video. Again, I would appreciate it if you joined my Discord server and if you subscribed. I'll see you later and have a great day.